Internet of Things. What does that mean? It's a global ecosystem of connected physical objects that can sense the environment, send data, communicate information without any human intervention. It's the crucible of disruption. It was a term that was coined in 1999 by Kevin Ashton. The first product that we could invest in as investors was actually produced by LG. It was a smart fridge. However, big lesson learned from this was, despite having a smart fridge, it was not connected to the internet. We didn't have wireless coverage in the way that we have it today. We also didn't have smart devices, the ubiquity of which now means that the Internet of Things is giving rise to multiple industries. Let's look at smart logistics. If we think about manufacturing industries a long time ago, just-in-time manufacturing was the big win when we were monitoring our supply chains and also actually matching our orders to the production lines. Smart logistics has taken that a step forward where we're using the Internet of Things, connecting trucks on the road to air freight to delivery of products all the way through to the end customer. Fidelity is interested in particular companies leveraging smart logistics, one of which is Amazon. This is an interesting lesson where the old labels no longer apply. What started as a books company became a portal to lots of different stores where online consumers, leveraging e-commerce, can purchase anything. Amazon has taken it a step further. They now want to be a fulfillment company. They want to fulfill all of their customer requirements. Their way of doing this, or ensuring that they can do this, is to manage their logistics and supply chain. They use GPS trackers to track products going into the logistics chain, they now have 40 767 freighters. It's entered the realm of FedEx and DHL because it wants to ensure that if you order a leaf blower over the internet that's for delivery on Tuesday at 5 p.m. to your home, that that leaf blower arrives at 5 p.m. on Tuesday at your home. Another company in the Australian realm that's using the internet of things or connectivity is Aconex. Aconex is an Internet of Things company because it's utilising that ubiquitous global connectivity to a shared collaborative software platform so that those in the field, contractors, project managers, etc., have real-time access to information that's being changed and updated all the time for workflow purposes. It has the ability to reduce costs by reducing time wastage and mistakes on building sites. As such, it's an amazing value proposition to all of those in the construction industry.